I've just woke up around nine. I went to bed at like four, so that's why I woke up at nine. And I'm now going to just add some sounds to the long form video I was editing last night, which is for the new brand, the social media growth brand. Then I'm gonna put the other long form video together, get them uploaded. Then I'm gonna edit personal brand vids, get all those uploaded as well as client vids. I've put the marketing team clips in the folder already for the marketing team. I did that yesterday night just before I went to bed because I recorded so many clips yesterday morning. So I've got some for today and I've got some for tomorrow. So I'll be able to skip that step for the next two days, which will speed me up a little bit. So, all right, so I finished editing the long form video for the sh uh, social media growth content brand. This looking really good top quality editing i've just added all the sounds and all the sound effects etc which has made it much better now i'm gonna do all my personal brand videos including both short form and long form so i need to put together yesterday's long form video and i need to edit today's short form videos right. i've finished uploading the short form video to my personal brand I've finished all of my short form videos, they're all uploaded. Um, I did another three client videos, they've all been uploaded. And now I'm going to... So I need to record another video for the social media growth brand. And I need to upload that video later tonight that I edited earlier and last night. I need to upload that later tonight. And I need to record another raw clip for that brand, a long form video for that brand. Um, I need to do another set of client vids to post tonight. And that's basically the minimum that I need to do. And if I get extra time, I'll edit another video for my normal personal brand. Um, I can start editing the social media growth long form video. And then obviously I've also got a train because time was tied today. I'm gonna to be doing weight training and like fight training together in one big session. So like a two, three hour training session, which I'll start at nine. I also wrote down a soliloquy. I wrote down some thoughts and I did one of the brainy books. I still need to do one of the others and then read for half an hour each book right now i'm going to do client videos record the long form video for the social media growth brand and once i've done that i'll record again all right so i've finished recording the long form video for the social media brand i'll probably start edit editing that later tonight i'm now going to read both both books so that'll take an hour it's currently 9 25 so at 10 25 i would have finished reading then i'll train till around 12 um and then i'll have to post client vids at around 12 i've already got those edited so i can post them um i don't think for minimum checklist there isn't anything else Obviously what I just said for the social media brand long form video, that's that's not on the minimum requirement. That's just if I get time. So I've technically managed to do extra today because I'm doing a long form video every other day. And I did one yesterday. So I could have waited till tomorrow, but I got enough time to do that one today. Um, and I'm also going to be doing short form content. I'm going to be replacing the new style that I started is... I found a more efficient way to post a similar style. So not editing style, but the same niche. So the new style that I started on social media growth and going viral and editing and stuff, I'm still gonna be in that, that niche. So I'll still be posting on the same accounts, but it will be me talking about how to go viral. I'll be able to go viral very quickly, I believe, because of the knowledge I have and the way I, the way I now know how to word it. I know how to word it properly to go viral, etc. I'm a lot better at speaking. Whereas before when I did it, 
I wasn't too sure how to word it to make it go viral. Whereas now I do. I'm also going to be posting that on the YouTube channel with the long form content, which with all the knowledge I'm going to be giving out, people are going to become very trustworthy of me because they'll see that I know what I'm talking about. So uh, that's going to go very well. And I have very high hopes for that this month. And the goal I set for this month, like 10k followers on that YouTube account, honestly, I'm going to put it fucking higher because the actions that I'm doing right now are very efficient. I've planned out in my head what each action is going to lead to and obviously I've written it down on my goals and it's very clear what each thing is going to lead to and if I just keep attacking now it's going to come very soon so and that's like that's like obvious as well it's something that has to happen if I keep doing what I'm doing I feel like that's the number one number one mistake people make not number one mistake, but when you first start like self-improvement, you have to try and find what is the right thing to do. And you're doing all these actions to try and make yourself feel like you're doing a lot of stuff. And I feel like that's what I'd been doing until around, until I ripped down those goals. So until like two weeks ago, one week ago, I've just been filling my days up with actions to try and make myself feel like I'm doing a lot. And as... The more like you're in this niche of trying to get rich, trying to do whatever it is you're trying to do and like progress. The more you start to realize over time that these actions are stupid, these actions are stupid, th this works, this leads to results, this leads to results. And eventually you get to that point, which I'm at now, where you find specific actions that are going to really lead to a real result. And I'm at that point now, so I just need to keep doing the actions that I'm doing now and my shit is going to blow up within the next like one to two months if I keep doing what I'm doing. And that is like planned out, like written, thought out, planned out, inevitable. It has to happen if I keep doing what I'm doing. So any advice for anyone that is trying to do the same as me right now is to write down what you're doing. And all the actions you do, write them down and really think, is this going to lead to something? If I do this for this amount of time, and I'm this consistent, is it actually going to lead to something? Then you can eliminate all the actions that aren't, and then you're going to find actions that are, and then you just focus on those. And then also write down goals, and write down... Look, these goals aren't unrealistic for me, but they're very fucking high. They aren't unrealistic, but they are very, very high. So every single time I look at them, I get excited. So you want to write down goals that are very, very high, that excite you when you look at them. And you want to write them down for within like two weeks or a month. And every single time you get distracted, look at those goals. And that's helped me a lot. So, but yeah, I'm now going to get to reading. It's now one in the morning. Oh, I finished creating a thumbnail. I spent like an hour doing a really good thumbnail for the video tomorrow. For the social media growth brand so um that's already <laughs> um i did my reading as well and yeah that's it so i'm now gonna go to i'm not gonna go to bed i can't can't think right now um, i'm not gonna go to bed and then i'm gonna wake up at six and I might record, might not, I don't know, I'll see.